What is going on, everybody? And welcome to a new episode of Where Is. On this episode, Where Is, ask the question, Where Is Fallout New Vegas 2? 2. Now, I know the chances of there actually being a Fallout New Vegas 2 is very slim as, for whatever reason, Bethesda doesn't want to work with outside studio developers anymore with any games that they develop. New Vegas was made by City Entertainment, who didn't even get a full development cycle to even make New Vegas and was forced to use you know, a very old, crappy engine. Yet still, in my opinion, New Vegas was the best Fallout game. Now, bugs aside, because well, it's still Bethesda, a Bethesda game, and we all know Bethesda leaves bugs and glitches in their games. Like polishing isn't anything that they ha they have. They don't have any kind of control to where they play their play test their games and get rid of bugs. They just release their games right out the gate, bugs all in. But anyways, you know. What made New Vegas so good? Now, this is a game that Obsidian spent just one year making, yet it had more story than both Fallout 3 and Fallout 4. It has more depth, better RPG elements, better choices, better factions, and making joining a faction actually have an impact. The second you decide to rock a faction armor set, you know, things change for you. You go into a, a, a Legion area wearing NCR gear, things you're, you're going to get shot at. You go into, you know, a Great Cons area wearing certain faction gear. Factions matter in New Vegas. Now, the world, though it is a, in a desert, is still lively and beautiful. Every single NPC has life in their own lines and personality, and not just lifeless beings wandering around saying the exact same lines as each other. Now, each merchant is unique to themselves. Yet again, this is a game that took only 18 months to make. Imagine if it had 3 or 4 years of production. In comparison to Fallout 4, a game that took 4 years to make and with a, a newer engine, Fallout 4 world is kind of dull. It's, it's a, there's a lot of houses and buildings around you, majority of which are either you know closed up or just empty. Every now and then you'll come across you know super mutants or ghouls, NPCs are you know boring and don't offer anything to the game. Every caravan is the exact same, you know, no unique dialogue. But I'm not going to go too deep into talking about the flaws of Fallout 4. You can watch my video. You can watch my video on what went wrong f for that. Um, New Vegas is just an all-around good game. Yes, it has flaws. All games have flaws. But you have to ask yourself, you know, would the game have the same flaws that it has if Obsidian had you know, more than 18 months to make the game? This is an RPG, for crying out loud. 18 months to make an RPG is, is insane. It's, it's crazy. You need way more time than 18 months to make an RPG. I'm definitely not complete. It's definitely not you know, a polished game. Definitely not entirely what the developer fully envisioned the game to be. Yet they got enough of their art into the game to where New Vegas is good. Yet it has, yeah, it has flaws, but you can get around that because the game itself is enjoyable. Yes, there are quality things that Fallout 4 did better, but those things are things that should be better in a game that released on PS4 and Xbox One. Four years plus of development versus an 18 month game on 360 and PS3. I would love New Vegas to get a sequel. I wish with Desert can reconsider their stance on not working with outside developers, or at least maybe buy out Obsidian and let them be, and let them make the sequel. You know, look, look around on YouTube. You know, new Vegas has a lot of fans, and will, they will love a new game. You know? So where is New Vegas 2? We may never get it, but in the, the world of video games, anything can happen. So with all that said, that is this fifth episode. Where is? I think you take the Archangel, the real unsung talent of YouTube. Thank you all for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Leave any thoughts you have in the comments below, and remember, be kind to one another. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.